بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته hello and welcome my dear sister our lesson of today which is going to be about life 4E and 4 round up this lesson is for the first secondary stage from second semester prepared by Amna Madkhali and presented by Yasser Nakhli today inshallah we will practice making and decoding short notes practice expressions with make and do practice future well will have to and will be able to Practice to and enough, practice relative clauses, who, which, that, and where, and practice computer related vocabulary. Now try this tongue twister, please. Okay, let's start. Can you live without it? Complete the blanks with one word, please. Okay, let's check answers. In my opinion, the internet is very important for many reasons. First of all, People are able to communicate with friends and family all around the world. What is more, people can look for and download information whenever they want to. In addition, they can make cheap online phone calls. Finally, or lastly, people can work from home because they are able to send their work through emails. Round up. Circle the correct words. Try to read this paragraph and circle the correct words, please. Okay, let's start. One of our most popular products is the navigator. This small, handy gadget will help you drive around the city without being worried about getting lost. It's very useful for new drivers, but also for anyone who wants to know their way around the city. It can even predict how long it will take you to reach your destination. So, visit any of our shops and get the navigator for only 100 euros. We care enough to make it a luxury you can afford. Buy it now and save 15 euros, keep the receipt and enjoy free service in the future. Now be complete sentences with who, which, that or where, if they can be omitted, put them in a bracket. Take your time and answer this question please. Okay, let's start. Number one, this is the house where Omar grew up. What do you think of it? Number two, have you looked at the pictures which my grandmother gave me? They are a hundred years old. Number three, let's meet at the fast food restaurant that is near the underground station. Number four, I have two sisters. Amina is the one is who is studying history? Number five, can you show me the office building where your brother works? I want to go and see him. Six, goulash is a kind of soup which they eat in Hungary. Seven, the writer who we met in London won an award last week. Okay, circle the correct words, please. Let's start. So, will you come shopping with me on Monday as soon as you get home from work? Sorry, I won't be able to. Amanda is coming round. But 
I will come with you another day. How about Tuesday? Okay, our shopping will have to wait till then. At around 4 p.m.? Yes, and I promise I won't be late. Number two. What will Greg do when he finishes his Spanish course? I think he'll go to Spain for a while. That's a good idea. He will be able to practice the language. Yes, he won't have anyone to help him, so he will have to speak Spanish. Okay, let's go to D. Complete the dialogues. Write sentences using to or enough. Okay, let's start. Number two. It's too hot in here. I'll turn on the air conditioning. Three. I don't have enough money. Don't worry. I'll lend you some money. Number four. This coffee is too bitter. I'll bring you some sugar. Number five. This fuzz isn't big enough. You should buy a bigger fuzz then. 6. These jeans are too small. Try on those jeans. I think they are a bigger size. Okay, today we learned practice making and decoding short notes, practice expressions with make and do, practice future well will have uh, to and will be able to, Practice to and enough. Practice relative clauses who, which, that, and where. Practice computer related vocabulary. These are the references to refer to in its book, workbook, sheets of guide, and Google Clip Arts for pictures. For more information and listen, please do not hesitate to call us on our website, our Twitter account, our phone number. Thank you and hope to see you again. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.